There were two boys, Ivan and Mykola. As neighbors, they spent a lot of time together. Ivan was bigger than Mykola, so he started to take his neighbor's toys to tease him and to call Kolya instead of Mykola. Mykola wanted to be friends with other kids. For some reason, this annoyed Ivan very much. When summer ended, Ivan returned to school. However, Mykola chose another school for himself. And again, Ivan was unhappy with Mykola's choice. He wanted his little neighbor to do as he Ivan wishes. The angry boy started to do mischief. He told Mykola's friends lies and tried to turn the kids against his neighbor, whatever it took him. Obviously, no one believed him. The kids understood that Ivan was just feeling offended and couldn't control his emotions. Ivan was completely taken over by his anger. He continued to take Mykola's toys, insulted him and even used force. The other kids saw this, so Ivan started to make up stories to avoid the punishment from the adults. He attacked me first. I only defended myself. A similar story goes on between two neighboring countries. Our home country Ukraine and the Russian Federation. A long time ago Ukraine has chosen its way and Europeans to be its friends. However, Russia is unhappy with the choice of Ukrainian people. Using force and lies, Russia tries to make Ukrainians live by its rules. In simple terms, Russia stole parts of Ukrainian territory and called them Donetsk and Luhansk People's Republics. They were fueling hostility in there and blaming it on Ukraine. Russia wants to convince everybody that its aggression is actually help, that the theft of Ukrainian territory is friendship that they wish to eradicate Ukrainian language and culture is care, and that the throwing of bombs on the cities is peace. However, the world sees who's the truth. Millions of people in the whole world go out on the streets with Ukrainian flags and support Ukraine. The most important thing now is to be able to distinguish truth from lies, because where the truth is, there is good, and the good always wins.